right, coming up next, it's a heavyweight collision between Bruce Lee and Kimbo Slice. Don't call him Kevin Ferguson. He, of course, is Kimbo Slice. And when you're talking about mixed martial arts and its footprint in the United States of America, Kimbo Slice is a guy who deserves a lot of credit for this mass expansion, at least in my mind. Absolutely, because when Kimbo Slice fought, people tuned in from the Ultimate Fighter to his days outside of the UFC. Some of the biggest TV ratings we've ever experienced are attributed to Kimbo Slice. He's a guy that people just want to see. From the backyard brawls to the octagon, Kimbo Slice is very special. And probably the nicest guy you would ever want to meet. He don't look like it. When that octagon he door doesn't closes. doesn't look like exactly. it, but he is a great guy. This is exciting here, DC. The founder of Jeet Kune Do, one of the founding fathers, really, of mixed martial arts. Bruce Lee is back in a big spot here tonight. Bruce Lee is what every kid looked to when they thought about doing karate. Bruce Lee is the person that anyone looked at when they said, I want to be a fighter. It was the speed. It was the charisma. It was the approach of Bruce Lee that made him so special. And tonight, he's going to look to show a new generation of fighters exactly how it's supposed to be done. And if you hear the phrase, drillers make killers, right? I mean, that was Bruce Lee in a nutshell. He felt like practice yes, would make yes. perfect. Nobody trained as hard as the great Bruce Lee. Our tale of the tape for this heavyweight fight. Four years apart, with big differences in height, but some differences in reach. To get us started, here is Bruce Buffer. Ladies and gentlemen, this is the main event of the evening. And when the action begins, our referee in charge, Herb Dean. And now, this is the moment UFC fans around the world have been waiting for. Live from the MGM Grand Garden Arena in Las Vegas. <laughs> This man is a boxer, holding a professional record of five wins, two losses, and one no contest. He stands six feet two inches tall, weighing in at 225 pounds. Fighting out of Miami, Florida, Kimbo Slice! And now introducing his opponent, fighting out of the red corner. This man is a mixed martial artist, making his professional debut here tonight. He stands five feet seven inches tall, weighing in at 145 pounds. Fighting out of Los Angeles, California, USA, Bruce the Dragon Lee. You've been giving your instructions in the dressing room. Protect yourself at all times. Follow my instructions. You will have a clean fight. Touch gloves, let's make it official. guy in the striker who knows exactly who he is. He knows where the fight needs to be. He knows what he has to do in order to be successful. Let's see if he can keep his opponent off of him. Well, we talked about his reach advantage off the top. Made good use of it there with that punch, DC. with a punch there, DC. You like this guy. I like this guy a ton. And to watch a punch like this puts a smile on my face. Well, he has certainly found the range and staying pretty busy here on the field. He's being busy, but it's also the timing and the accuracy 
that's allowing him to land so many attacks. I mean, he's cutting down the size with these beautiful leg kicks. Oh, tags him with the straight. Nice job there by Lee. Slice's lower jaw does not look good. I don't think it's broken, but starting to show some obvious signs of swell. Lee's keeping those feet in perpetual motion, circling to his right now. Just missed with the left there. Effective strike there by Lee. Oh, head kick. Cross, though, by Slice. Just misses there with the left. Slams the right hand. Yeah, left hook found its target. Nice hook. Oh! Oh, straight right. The left hook has not missed yet. He has to keep throwing that hook. They say the straight hooks are the ones that get there first, and it got right to the target. Oh, beautiful straight left hand. What a punch. They continue to exchange. Tom his shots pretty well here early, DC. He's doing a great job of mixing things up, keeping busy, being very active. Big head kick lands. Oh, he moved right into the kick there. A kick to the head lands, and he's shown a susceptibility to that in fights prior. You can't lean into those power shots. Let's see if he can circle out and make the adjustments here. All right, he'll engage in a single collar tie. Going to the body there with the right kick. Big punch lands over the top. I'll just follow this. Oh, oh. Serve him up. Go get him. Oh! My goodness! Trying to establish that jab once again. Back to good position. This is where he has done a ton of good work here. Punch, punch, punch to the head from the clinch. Oh, nice connection there with the punch, DC. Great time to land that punch. Well, how about this approach here tonight? Technical striker, and he has gone bad. Very accurate, but really just an all-out aggressive approach that we haven't seen from him in the past. You see him land the jab there. He's got the reach advantage. You might as well use it. Flicks the guard, lands the right hand. Oh, nice. Nice. Body kick now by Lee. Oh, misses with the jab. 30 seconds now to go in the round. <laughs> 20 seconds left. Single collar tie now. Devastating uppercut. Final seconds. Big ball for punch land. Now we get back to range. Slice's lower jaw very swollen now. Time to bite down on the mouthpiece and move forward. All right, so we now look back at some of the action from that previous round, DC. A lot of good highlights on both sides. I mean, a lot of good highlights from both competitors. They both should be very proud of what they accomplished. But I'm telling you, man, I'm not sure they can keep this up. If they land at this clip for another five minutes, somebody's going to sleep. You ready to fight? Ready. Second round underway. Punches in bunches, and he hasn't really shown any signs of slowing down here tonight. I'm not sure how much more his opponent can take. You don't really stand after you take a head kick like this. 
this. That is such toughness. Even be on his feet right now. Looked like he might have landed there. Instead, a swing and a miss by Slice. Nice leg kick. Let's get some offense. Let's get going. Oh. Oh, nice right here. Throwing haymakers out of the exchange. Come on, man. I need more punches. Let's go. Throw those punches. Wind it up on the right there to no event. He changes the angle, finds the right spot to land that punch to the head of the clinch. Spinning back fist. Well, he's looking for that left hand. Just out of range, though, with it. Oh, he's hurt. Oh, he might be out. Whoa! He's in trouble. He's hurt bad. He got him. Shot is blocked there by Lee. You don't know what that leg is. Oh! Beautiful punch. He's looking to land the right just out of risk. Just over three minutes to go. Good use of his reach advantage as he lands the straight punch there. That shot blocked by Lee. Oh, that right hand is on point. Big liver kick lands under the elbow. Well, a really good second round for him thus far. After a somewhat lackluster first round, he has found the rhythm and found his striking range. Scary proposition for the opponent now here in round two. Nice punch lands over the top. Again, he's looking for that left. It's not there. Right punch is there. Oh, nice job defensively there to get the guard up. Shot is blocked by Slice. Big punch lands. Big body piece lands. Wow. I see the color tie now. Just out of range with that left hook. Ooh, blocks the shot. He continues to stay busy. What do they say, DC? Punches in bunches? Punches? Oh! Oh! That's it here, DC. He massive, massive hook lands. And his opponent seems to be on his way out of the fight. He went high on that one. up here, but he is on wobbly legs. Look at how he turns his hip over when he throws that kick. Slice gets hit by that kick to the midsection. You gotta do better defensively. Connects with a right. 30 seconds to go in round two. Oh, he just continues to pour it on. He has been aggressive all night long with his striking. Gotta be careful here to not empty the gas tank. So far, so good, though, in this round. Straight right, he misses. 10 seconds now to go in the round. Ten minutes in the books. All right, so there's the horn signifying the end of the round. A stunner there with the head strike midway through. Nearly got him out of there for good. Almost got him out of there. He hurt him badly. He had his opponent hurt real bad. Now his opponent's walking back to his corner. Everybody looks confused. They don't know what they're supposed to do 
to try to change the way that this fight is going. Continues to land a high number of strikes here, just like he did in the previous round. This is a world-class display of striking here tonight. Slice gets touched by that kick to the body. All right, good job by him there to raise the guard and protect his head. He's doing a good job of keeping the guard high, blocking his head, making sure he's not taking those damaging strikes up top. Nice punch lands over the top. Over and over, he's landed these big body kicks. How about that shin? Kick to the head there by Lee. All right, so another swing and a miss. And I'd imagine if your gas tank is this low, you got to find times to try to preserve that energy and, and get yourself back to a place where you can actually dole out some damage. Yeah, you got to get out the space. Find places to rest and recover. Get against the octagon. Go to the clinch. Find ways to just recover so that when you have that next explosion, it actually has some meaning to it. Oh, huge block! Kimbo Slice gets caught with that punch. Oh, he tagged him with the other. To throw at the exact right moment. He deserves this moment. Go finish this fight. Oh, there's the swing and there's the miss by Lee. Oh! Oh, he's hurt bad. He's hurt bad, John. He's got to press him. He's got to go chase that finish down now. Just over three minutes to go in round three. Oh, he landed another great shot to the body there. Really starting to connect at a high percentage now in the latter stages of this fight. Oh! Oh! And just like that, the fight is over! Oh, my goodness! What a fight! Yeah, there's another one for the highlight reel, and that's probably as good a knockout as he's had in the UFC. Just a perfect shot to end the fight. Crowd absolutely loving it. Flush land to close out his opponent. I'm not even sure the other fighter saw it coming. So a big knockout for him here tonight on the biggest of stages. And there he is, all smiles. What a huge knockout he turned in here tonight. That is one they'll be talking about for some time. Ladies and gentlemen, referee Herb Deans called a stop to this contest at two minutes, seven seconds of round number three. Playing the winner by Ruth the Dragon. Well, he's smiling ear to ear, and why not after a knockout like that? I need a ticket to the after party. Tonight. I mean, this is what dreams are made of. You dream of the knockout like this, and then the party after, where you and all your coaches get to celebrate the great handiwork. All right, let's get you some replays now. Certainly a lot for our replay guys to work with in the truck. This was a clinic tonight in terms of mixed martial arts acumen in every realm. A full-on split of all of his skills. He did everything in this championship-winning performance. He used his wrestling. He used his elbows. He used his pace and pressure to really wear 